This is a one month review of my Ybot pool vacuum cleaner. It's rechargeable. Uh, it runs about two hours after I charge it. Charging time is roughly about five hours. Uh, but I charge off my solar system so no cost utility bills. This thing's pretty neat. The, the bottom carriage has uh, two inlets where it sucks in debris. One over there, one over there. It's got like a sweeper brush on the bottom, wheels, and so all the debris gets stuck in here, and this filter sits on top. So all the all the water comes up through this filter. It just sits down in there like that, and all the debris stays underneath it. Now this, so the plug is right here. You unplug it, and then you have this rubber plug that goes over top. And there's only one way it goes on. You make sure that's on all the way and that keeps it waterproof. And then it just uh, sits on top. Like so. Clips in, make sure it's down all the way. What I think is neat is when it's thrusting, this will thrust out. It'll go one way until it hits a wall in about three to four seconds. Uh, after coming to a stop, it'll turn around and go the other direction. And the wheels are free flowing, so it bumps right over the pool drain, um, other debris, so it doesn't really stop because the wheels aren't driving it, it's the thrust of the water. So that's what I really like. I've been impressed with this thing, it sucks up quite a bit. I'm gonna put it in the water and watch it go. So you can set it right on top, make sure the string, this uh, ringlet here floats so you know where it's going at all time in the pool. So you turn the knob, make sure that plug is down. Turn the knob until it turns blue. That means it's ready to go. You just drop it in the water. And make sure it lands on its wheels. And you just throw that in the water. And it's actually fairly fast once it gets going. Oh, there it goes. Watch it hit that pool drain. It bounces right over and it just goes in another direction. But wherever where it goes, there's a clean sweep. So it sweeps up, sucks in all kinds of leaves, debris, whatever's on the bottom. Bumps the hood and you count it about three seconds. And then it'll uh, turn around and go the other way. So it's a plug and play. I walk away, I come back out in about two hours and I see it's blinking red or it's, it's a solid red. And the nice thing about it is when it gets really weak, it will rest at the last point. So it's always at the edge of the pool. So you can just reach over and grab the string, pull it back out of the pool. So, so far, uh, definitely money well spent. Um, no more hooking up the hoses and vacuums and whatnot and watching it, monitoring it, and this thing goes by itself. I have yet to have it uh, get stuck on anything, so um, nice low maintenance vacuum cleaner. Uh, definitely worth the money. Saved me a lot of time of uh, hand sweeping and, and vacuuming with a, a hose into the filter system. So uh, there you go.